Virus infections in Virginia and that surge is putting even more pressure on hospitals in the Commonwealth already pushed to the brink. Northern Virginia Bureau reporter Drew Wilder continues our coverage. The year that so many of us want to forget ends with a COVID infection rate we cannot escape. We are seeing higher numbers than we've ever seen. There are more COVID patients in Virginia hospitals right now than ever before. Even while doctors have found other ways to treat these patients, ventilator use is also at an all-time high. For Eileen Doman at Mary Washington Medical Center, the numbers do not tell the story. I don't pay attention to the statistics that are out there published. I look at how many people, patients we have in beds that are requiring COVID level care, and it is scary. Her nurses are assigned to more patients than they usually see. But that's also true at Winchester Medical Center, where the mental toll on staff couples with the ongoing threat of transmission. You know that you're being exposed to that as well as all the other tolls it's taking. And, and you may contract something that could lead to your death or the death of one of your loved ones. Um, and so it's a it's a reality that we haven't lived before. Today, Virginia distributed more than 100,000 more vaccines to the front lines. Nearly 390,000 vaccines total are available in Virginia, but less than 20% of them are actually in people's arms. While the general public waits for its turn, hospitals are preparing for the cases to continue climbing. We're expecting numbers to continue to increase. We're we're prepared. Um, you know, we're, we think that what we're seeing now is a, a rise in cases related to holiday gatherings and travel, and we are just getting through the Christmas and New Year's season. We're anticipating another increase. Expecting the new year to begin in a dangerous direction. Reporting in Northern Virginia, Drew Wilder, News 4. The Virginia Department of Health says the state's hospital beds are more than 80% full at the moment. Over the past 10 months, we 